This quick presentation from showmehowtodothis.com is going to show you how to add JPEG pictures, JPG pictures, to a PowerPoint slideshow. So inside of PowerPoint here, I have one slide open, and it's just the basic formatted slide inside of PowerPoint. And so what I'm going to do is actually copy this slide over here, and I'm just going to paste it a couple of times. And I do that by right-clicking. And then I go up to the Insert tab, and I'm going to go Insert Picture from File. And I want to navigate to the folder I want to navigate to. So let's just say I wanted to show pictures from the 2006 Colorado blizzard. And um, here is a picture of me shoveling snow. So there's that picture, and then here's, let's say, insert picture from file. Here is a picture of the, oh, here's another picture of me shoveling snow. And here's a picture, we'll go insert picture from file. Here's a picture of the stairs in front of the driveway. All right, so that's the big snowstorm we had here in Colorado. And this actually looks pretty decent, but if I want to, I can resize it and do whatever I want to do to make this picture fit the screen. So that would be the full slide, or if I wanted to, I could you know, put in a little text box down here. I'd probably get rid of that little text box and say, me with lots of snow. And then this picture obviously doesn't fit uh, because it's an uh, up and down picture. So what I'm going to do is actually resize it so that it will fit onto that particular slide. And then I can go to the slide and if I want to, I can change the background color of that slide so that it's, let's just say, teal. So when I actually put together a PowerPoint show, then this slide will be teal in the background. This will be white and this will show up with me with lots of snow as the caption. So. That is a quick video from showmehowtodothis.com about how to add JPEG or GIF pictures. You could add GIF, any sort of pictures, into a PowerPoint slideshow. So I hope this has been helpful for you. Please feel free to come back and visit us on the site at any point in the future at showmehowtodothis.com.